I think the standard of um, the Proteas, at least, who we had an opportunity to work with, has been really good. Um, I was very impressed at the way the girls challenged themselves at uh, World Champs, and they took on board everything that we were feeding them, and I was, it was really good to see the, the application um, transfer onto court, and uh, I think that's what got us to fifth position. They were willing to step out of their comfort zone and really try something else and challenge themselves. So yeah, it was excellent. They they did a great job. The, the competition for um, Australia and, and New Zealand is up against one another continuously, and that is the one thing that South South Africa and not only South Africa, the rest of the world lack is that intensity competition week in, week out. Now, I also had um, recommended to South African Nipple that they should extend the Brutal Fruit competition and have the players on that playing that higher standard for a longer period, which would help um, the players be far more attuned when stepping onto the international court. So I'm pleased to see that they've uh, introduced that and I'm hoping that's the start of building it up. Well, I think a coach really... Um, these days they've got to be everything to everyone. They've got to know how each player learns because all the players have different learning styles, although these days I'm finding you know, 90% will be totally visual and they need to see whatever you're trying to explain in the drill. They need to see it in more than one way. They're that used to being on you know, their iPads and their um, phones and texting and everything else that Visually, they pick it up quicker, but sometimes we do have to show it in more than one direction. So, so that's a, a different thing over the years when I could verbally tell a player how to, to work a drill, but now it's about you know showing all the time. Um, and I and I think that um, uh, within the the coaching ranks at the moment, I think the it's got to be um, pushing the players to harder intensity. And running the session this morning, that the coaches could see that. You know, our, our sessions are a hell of a lot more physical because when you get on the international court, that's what you've got to deal with. So if you don't work up against it, you can back out of situations very quickly. And we um, did do a lot of work with your proteas, you know, for World Cup on being able to step up and not step away from a contest. So that's the sort of thing they need to really start pushing on now. The Under-21 camp is really about me um, assisting Durette to have a look at you know, what she's dealing with and um, not actually running the sessions but um, there to assist her and to mentor her and her other coaches into what we see and how we would um, add to it or take it in a different approach or you know certainly want to see what the intensity is like so that we can talk to them about lifting the standard on that because again um, you know Australia, England, New Zealand are not going to back off and uh, you want your under 21s and you know, a couple of the players that we had this morning, one of your shooters in the under 21s, she's a beautiful mover. So I think you've got the talent, it'll again be about the training methods.